As the weather's got colder, it's more important now to make sure that you're fully loosened up to play golf. So I'm just going to run through how I would loosen up to play 9 or 18 holes of golf. Sometimes I don't get as much time as I want, so there's other things that I will do to try and speed the process up. But my normal thought process for uh, loosening up is actually to take it very slowly. So I've got my log wedge. This would be my first shot of the day, and it's simply a very small movement, pretty much chipping it. And I would hit quite a few shots like this before I even entertained hitting a full swing. I normally play a game on the simulator where however far my shot has gone, I try and hit it anywhere between one and five yards longer, just so I've got something to try and aim for and feel. And whilst I'm hitting short shots, it means that it's easier to get the middle of the club face, so I'm helping myself strike it as well. So just keeping it simple, building the swing up, going a little bit further back and a little bit further through, just gently easing my body into a fuller and fuller swing. Once I've hit five or six or seven shots with my lob wedge, I'll move on to a less lofted club. And obviously whilst I'm doing this, I'm also walking to get the golf ball, I'm getting the blood flowing, everything's just gently loosening me up for my round of golf. So I'm up to 44 yards now, so maybe I'll hit one more to try and get to 50. Not too bad, that one's gone around about 55. So I'll change clubs and I move up to my 54. Ball's going to start going a little bit further now, swinging back a bit further, swinging through a little bit further. So up to 70 yards now. So I just hit a few more with this one. Try one more with this and then we'll go with my gap wedge. So onto my 50, getting up to 90 yards now, so this is going to go closer to 100. I can feel that my body is just loosening up, so it feels like I can make a bit more of a backswing now. I can probably go fractionally quicker on the way through. There we go, that sort of hits 100 yards now, so it's not far off. So I'll hit one more with the 50 and move on to the pitching wedge. So as the club is getting that little bit longer now, hopefully I'm still catching it out of the centre of the club and feeling confident. So I've hit 12 shots now and I'm feeling that my body from start to now is getting to the point where I'm pretty much 90% loosened up without sort of doing anything too aggressive. So I'm going to move on to an even longer club now. I'm into my 7 iron. If I'm fully loosened up then I know the yardage of this will be 160 plus. Hopefully with the right strike, if I get to 160, I know I'm there or thereabouts. Quite 
quite straight that one, but it's gone reasonably straight. And that's carried closer to 150 than 160, so I know I'm not quite loosened up yet. Better strike on that one, and that's getting closer now. That's sort of close to 155. So it's not going to be long before I feel that I'm ready to play golf. So they're all sort of landing in the 150s now, so I've hit 16 shots so far, it just shows you if I'd have gone out onto the first tee, 16 shots in, I'm still not loosened up. So it's not taking that long, let's see if we can get up to full speed now. So that's now closer to the 160 mark. Once I've hit some seven irons at that kind of distance and a little bit more, I would then move on to a longer club, five iron or six iron, followed by a hybrid. So I've probably hit at least 30 shots before I tee off on the first. If you can send in what you would normally do to loosen up, um, if it's walking to the first tee and having a cup of tea, then if you haven't got time, one of the exercises that you can do is if you grab hold of four iron and five iron or five iron and six iron, just get a couple of clubs, hold them together, and if you hold those two clubs together, it doesn't really matter how you grip them, just however you feel is comfortable, and you start swinging those two clubs together, that's quite a nice way with two clubs rather than one that will really start getting your body working in the correct manner. So there are things, if you haven't got time, that you can do, but if you can send in some tips for us, what would you do to loosen up? And we'd love to hear from you.